popularly known as Community Right to Know, this new bylaw and supporting program will enable the public to obtain information on the thousands of facilities in the city that use or release toxic chemicals. As a result of this program, our children can look forward to a cleaner and healthier city in which the presence of toxic chemicals in the Toronto environment, and particularly its air, will decrease greatly in the future. The Water Efficiency Program has led to a greener Toronto in so many ways. First of all, our incentive programs have reduced water use by 55 million litres of water each and every day. We will avoid over 90,000 tonnes of CO2 emissions and the incentives can be reinvested for other green initiatives. It preserves our most precious resource and the environment for future generations. Well, I'm proud of the uh, Food Policy Council and I'm proud of the City of Toronto. It's one of the few cities in the world that's taken the lead in helping citizens be more effective, both as advocacy groups and as uh, organizations in their own right. And I think we've done a number of things to make the city greener. We were a pretty key part of uh, the green roof uh, decision, the local food uh, purchasing uh, decision. We uh, were pretty influential in trying to save the green belt as an area for food production. And uh, we're always trying to link food as an environmental and as a social issue and, and help people understand that it's not just the environment sitting off by its side, but it's crucial to solving all sorts of problems in our society. It is so exciting and such an honour to be selected as one of the finalists for the Bob Hunter Environmental Achievement Award. It's an honour that I share with the entire service program's water efficiency team, our program partners and the over 300,000 voluntary participants that have directly contributed to the success of our program. I'm very proud to be a citizen of a city and to work for a city which gives a hand to environmental groups, helps them be more effective and to gain access to the resources they need to do their job properly. Toronto Public Health are so excited to be recognized for leading the creation and successful adoption of Canada's first environmental reporting and disclosure bylaw.